Hey guys, how's it going and welcome to another video and today, today we're in Manchester and behind me is the Bugatti Chiron being unloaded off the trailer as we speak and we are heading over to see somebody that you're probably quite familiar with, somebody that you probably already know. Uh, let's see how he enjoys the Bugatti Chiron and uh, I heard he's quite excited to see it. So let's get the car off the truck and head on over to go see Tommy Fury. So guys, we have finally arrived here in Manchester and uh, we are with the main man himself, Mr. Tommy Fury, ladies and gentlemen. Tommy, say hi to my What's audience. What's going on? What's going on, people? <laughs> if you guys don't already know, I'm pretty sure you do already know, Tommy is a boxer. Tommy is also a huge personality. And today, it's an honor to have him uh, check out the Bugatti Chiron wrapped in the Lannister Libre. What do you think of the car first impressions, bro? Well, unbelievable. It definitely looks the money it is, I can say that. <laughs> um, but no, the only time I've seen one of these is uh, when Floyd Mayweather was driving it on his uh, 20 No, he, he, he doesn't even have a Chiron. This is no. a, that was a Veyron, this is a Chiron. No so that's 1.2 million, this is 3.5. But it's value for money when you come to see it, you know? And then the interior wise as well, it's just so simple and basic. I mean, you'll see that when we go for a drive, but the main, the main part of this whole thing, bro, is the engine, is the W16. So if you go around to the back, you'll see that it has a 1500 on it, a W16. W16 is basically two V8 engines bolted together, right? So you've got 16 cylinders yep. and then you've got four turbos. So for example, a Lamborghini Urus or a um, Mercedes C63 would have a bi-turbo, would have two turbos. This yep. will have four turbos, it's a quad turbo. So the two spool on low, uh, low torque and the two at high torque. Um, and you'll see when we get into the car and when we drive it, the, vo the sound, everything. I mean, look, let me just start it up. You stay there. It's like, it's like if Darth Vader was a, uh, was a car, this would be it. Um, other than that, it's all good looking at it, but I think the main thing we need to do is get in it and I try it out. So, I think so. <laughs> Let's go. Just a quick little fuel stop here in Manchester with the Chiron. Uh, we've had a good little 20, 30 minute drive through Manchester. Tommy's loving it. He's already on the phone to Bugatti and he's <laughs> going to be ordering one next week. Yeah. So look, I beg you don't record in the back of Wimslow Road, please. <laughs> we have stopped off for a spot of lunch and uh, yeah, from the settings, you're probably thinking, where is this? Seeing as we're in Manchester, it's important that we visit Wimslow Road. I've always liked coming here for uh, getting some food and whatever. Uh, I asked Tommy as well, do you mind getting a bite to eat? And he says, yeah, I'll have a kebab with you. So here's the Chiron. We've got some lovely uh, people over from Manchester that are also spotting the car, um, getting to enjoy the chrome blue Lannister Chiron. Um, it's nice, first time ever I brought it down to Manchester. Got a great reception. I wish I can uh, be here for a little bit 
bit longer. I'm only here for the day, uh, but inshallah, in the future, I'll be back again with the Chiron. So guys, if you're from Manchester and you haven't seen it today, if you haven't seen it whilst this video is being recorded, don't worry, I will be back. Hey guys, we are in the interior of the Bugatti Chiron. I've very kindly asked if uh, Tommy can <laughs> hold the in-car camera. I forgot my GoPros at home, so thank you, Tommy, for that. I'm pretty no sure problem. your arms are not going to hurt there. Well. Nice and strong. <laughs> Tommy, first of all, congratulations on one of your most recent fights. Thank uh, you, thank what you. What a great job you've done. Got him out real, real quick, and uh, yeah. nice to see uh, you make uh, the Fury name proud again. Uh, we're in the Chiron. We're heading through your city, Manchester. I know we've just uh, hit that motorway, and you've got to experience some of the speed up to 70 miles per hour. Obviously. Crazy, crazy it? stuff. It was. It's like being on a roller coaster. It's, and the most impressive thing about it is you can't feel anything. It's like riding on a cloud. You know, it's definitely worth the money, as you can tell. So what about the what about the quad turbos and the listen to this? It gets better every time. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't even the best part. Let's get the best part going. Right? Oh, it's that it's that tss at yeah. the end of it, you know. So you were thinking of getting uh, a new car, right? Yeah. And we were just debating Mercedes or BMW. Yeah. Right? Have you always been a Mercedes fan? Uh, mostly, yeah. I mean, BMWs are good. Yeah. Um, but I don't know what it is about the Mercedes. Probably the comfort level and the interior. Yeah, the ambient lighting. I've always liked a big car as well. Mm -hmm. A big four before, so I always tend to go towards the Jeep wagon. Bro, we've just entered Dean's Gate, right, Manchester. Just look at that ahead, right? Yeah. All the car spars are out. They're loving it. <laughs> they love it. Madness to be fair. <laughs> How, do huh? How do they know we're here? How do they know we're here? These are supercar spotters in Manchester. Crazy. Look at them, everywhere. So you brought us into Dean's Gate. Well, you haven't brought us. I kind of wanted to come to uh, Dean's Gate, Manchester. And uh, the roads here, bro, I'm not going to lie. They're not exactly the greatest, are they? No, Pop no. Potholes heaven. Yeah, it's like topsy turning all the way through the city. I love it. Every time I accelerate, he's Every time. <laughs> We're going to enjoy a nice drive through Manchester with Tommy. Um, I'm going to get him to check the car out more. Maybe even tempted to get one in the future. Yep. 100%. 20 and 0, baby. 20 and 0, baby. That's the car. <laughs> Not even Floyd Mayweather has been in a Bugatti Chiron yet. So, uh, Tommy, if that's something to go by, I think um, the future is set out. I'm ahead of the game, What colour would you go for? Ooh, I'd probably go for either a red or a black. Yes, my, yeah. my, my yeah. car's actually black behind this wrap, so once the wrap's taken off or whatever. We'll have to do it again. Yeah, we'll have to do it all over again. Right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna carry on going for our little drive. Tommy, you can say bye to him, and uh, yeah, let's enjoy this bumpy ride. Take it easy, guys. <laughs> So guys, we have made it back to base, had a little spin around Manchester with my friend Tommy and also we had a kebab. The kebab was nice, huh? Kebab. Fill the good void. <laughs> <laughs> had to go down Wimmy Road and get a kebab in the Bugatti Chiron. Um, I'm always speechless when I drive this car. I've mentioned that in pretty much every video. And Tommy, you are also left. Speechless. I'm not speechless. You know, there's nothing to say about it. It's um, the best car I'll ever sit in. I think it's safe to say that. Yeah. Um, and just look at it, breathless every time. Oh, you can look at that smiley face all day long. So where I've been sharing my info on cars with Tommy, Tommy's been also letting me know about the world of boxing. You guys know that I'm starting to indulge in a little bit of boxing here and there. Tommy's obviously getting those uppercuts in. I don't know if you watched his last fight, but second round knockout. So it's, uh, it's important that I pick up a few tips. Anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Make sure you subscribe, share and like. And who knows, you might be seeing more of Tommy on my channel. Leave that in the comments below, people. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Make sure you subscribe, share, and like. And I'll see you soon for more. Take it easy. God bless. Tommy, I normally end the videos like, like yeah, this, yeah, yeah. but I need you to just punch the yeah. lens. Don't break it. Take it easy, guys. God bless. Bye-bye.